Good morning to you. I'm Shayla, and I had to uh, spend some time this morning manning up to get ready for the mans who just walked through the door. We We've jogged got... through the door. Yes, honey, and I'm so glad. <laughs> if that was a jog, oh my God. <laughs> I'm so glad that David, man, was able to hear and see me. He's been having some issues. <laughs> These He's falling apart. been tearing me up like this different oh, weather. So how I, did she say it? I should have brought <laughs> like a little C&I dog and all yeah, that. Uh, something, yeah, something. Yeah, well, let's me. try to get through this interview before you fall apart, start crumbling <laughs> okay. right here. We have to pick up I'm the pieces. Together. So we're going to have some Fun. We're gonna play the manly wet game. Okay. All right. Which means that we're gonna ask you questions about your spouse. Okay. Mm-hmm. And the one that gets the most questions right is the winner. So we're gonna start with uh, David. So Tamala has to put the headphones on. Okay. So when your wife says, "Honey, they're playing our song," what song are they playing? Secret Lovers. What? <laughs> All right. Finish the sentence. My spouse first kiss made me think. Did this girl just put her tongue in my mouth? The first kiss? Y'all was fast. <laughs> Who was interested in marriage first, you or your wife? She was. <laughs> you can take it off you can now take it off. and give it to him. Uh, now we're talking to yeah, yeah. Tamala. All right, you ready? I'm ready. All right, what would your husband say was the last thing you argued about? Our biggest argument was over tuna. Strangest gift he ever gave you? Was a chocolate cake. And what one item of clothing do you wish that he would throw away? Of his? <laughs> Yeah, I'm sure you have a lot to choose from. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Uh, well, he oh, actually lost God. it. It was this hat he had that he would not let it go. My daughter accidentally yeah. lost it. Oh, accidentally. <laughs> okay. <laughs> you can take your headphones off. Okay. Very good. <laughs> All right. We've got Tamala Man and David Man here to see who can get the most correct out of the manly wet game. All right, Tamala. When you say, honey, they're playing our song, what song are you talking about? Secret Lovers. Secret Lovers. <laughs> Both what is that? Did, is that how this started knew, out? Nobody knew, knew that we, we were dating. dating. And then all of a sudden we were married. Yes, we and were singing together and everything, but then nobody knew we was liking each other. Really? And all of a sudden, boom, we're married. And they was like, where did this come from? But y'all so, didn't play it at the wedding, though. Did no, you? Okay. we didn't. <laughs> <laughs> but it was our little inside joke. Okay, so my spouse's first kiss made me think. Our first kiss we was playing. And what? And uh, oh, uh, mommy, oh, when I put my tongue in your mouth. <laughs> <laughs> I tell you, yeah. Miss Fasty. I said, did this girl just put her tongue oh in my, my mouth? Oh, my gosh. Okay, <laughs> finally. I tell nobody that. Who was interested in marriage first? He asked me, but I didn't answer. So you so said it was you, me? Yes. Girl, you going to make them turn my pimp card in. It was you. <laughs> you I, I mean, I wanted it, but I, ne- I never said it to you. That was that's a dispute right there. Yeah, I, see uh-uh. that no, that's a wrong answer. That's, that's false. That that's a wrong uh-uh. answer. <laughs> I, I still had my pimp card. I uh, I no, wasn't you knew gotta that turn it in. I didn't come to you and say let's get married. Well, but Thank you was you. interested. You, put, you were throwing marriage hints. No, but you came and said we're gonna get married. You didn't even ask me. That's how he that's how I told you I had my pimp card. That's how we do. I believe you. I believe you, Tam. I believe you. You don't say you will you marry. You say we getting married and pick a date. And that's All how right. we do. Let's see how good you match her answers. Okay. All right. What would you say was the last thing y'all argued about? Oh, the biggest argument you had was about tuna fish sandwich. What? Yes, it was right. <laughs> but what? It was. It, Who argued? it was. It was a long day. It, so we don't have enough time for us to sit here. And it explain wasn't it. about the tuna fish sandwich. It was the fact that I didn't appreciate her making me the tuna fish sandwich. After I had worked eight hours, went grocery shopping at three different stores, and came home and said, "Well, it's so late." I'm just going to make tuna fish. That's cool. He said, yes. So I made the tuna fish sandwich and came and in. I like, and I even brought it to him. Served right. it. Had his little Aww. chips and sandwich. And he was going to bite it. He bit it. And he said, did you put, did you put any relish on this? Like, with attitude. She said, you ungrateful like, N-word. Ninja. Oh. <laughs> yes, to the 10th power. <laughs> All right, what's the strangest gift you ever gave her? The strangest gift I ever gave her, some Vera Wayne cologne. Vera Wayne oh, no. She didn't don't like, say it. Don't, like, don't say it. Sorry, Vera. Well, I mean, she just, it wasn't strange. She just was like, it was new to her. 
I didn't it was know. new. She, she knew for the dresses, but she didn't know the cologne right. and all that. But, yeah, that was. What did you say? The strangest one. I would say the one thing you gave me that I didn't like was that chocolate cake. Oh, that was that was her birthday. I never bought another chocolate cake. That was our first year of marriage. You gave her that as a gift? It was what? her birthday. I just called myself trying to, you know, it's the first year. I'm going to get her a birthday cake when she get home from work. Oh, this chocolate. is the first year. So yeah. you figured, yeah. okay. So she came in and Nothing bit the chocolate big. I don't eat chocolate cake. I did. And I should have said, you ungrateful. Ninja. Ninja. <laughs> that was fun. Tamala Mann and David Mann are here in studio with us talking about a whole lot of stuff. Mainly is this reality show that's on TV One on Tuesdays at 8 p.m. And let me tell you, I love that song, Secret Lovers. And something else we have in common is that I also have a puppy named Smokey. Do you? And you still have him? How I old is he? I still have him. He's three. He'll be three oh, in a couple of days. Smokey would have been 11. He was wow. turning 11. It was he was older like, than our grandkids. Yeah, so it was like wow. a, I was <laughs> caught in the middle where I could have him surgery, but it wasn't. they wasn't sure if it was going to really work right. or not. So Wow. Well, you can always babysit my Smokey. No, we got Smokey. I, know. Like, I, I know. saw that. Man. Prince. Prince. Yes. <laughs> I've I've gone a little far. I let no, Prince no, she's sleep in the way bed with me, but he Prince sleeps with me. But he's smaller. You he's know, like, I'm trying to get intimate, and I'm running over trying to get a little rub on. <laughs> Girl, is this a bush? <laughs> and and a you know, he already got vision problems. <laughs> he be done trying to kiss the dog or something. Don't do that I'm to him. I'm thinking like, what the? You need to shave from under your arm, I'm and it's the dog. You, I'm telling you, the the man's the reality show is gonna be off the hook. Yeah, I mean, it's just this pre- funny. Yes, we yeah. premiered last Tuesday, but we come on Tuesday nights, eight o'clock Eastern, and we it's going higher and higher. I'm telling yeah. you, we're gonna be doing some things that you'll be like, what is wrong with these? If people? you missed the, the if you missed this past the premiered show, you seen I put the family like I made the family like face your fears. Well. I yes, yes, I saw that. It was, yeah, it was a mess. Yeah, it, it was like fear. Think of fear factor and eating. That's all I'm going to say. <laughs> well, you and can go back and what, watch it. Go, you, you can go, go back and watch it. Go back yeah. and watch it. it. It's the premiere. They ate bugs. So first yeah. I pulled the crickets out of them, but the, actually the crickets were good. So then, David, they made you face your fears. Well, see, not only am I claustrophobic, but they put me in a box, right? And I'm cool with that. And they lied and said they were drilling some holes. We did so drill I them in there so you could breathe. That's true. They lied. That's and true. what did they do? They put a rat in the <gasps> box with me. That's my biggest fear. That's mine too, David. He, I would have died. I wouldn't have been here to see, talk about that. You got to go look that, and see what he, happened to the box. He towed that box up. He kicked that box up. Oh, we got to go and see that. Yeah. We got to go to the TV One website? The TV, man. Yes. TV One. It's on TV One website. You yes. can go see. Oh, my God. All right. So tell me about this show that you two are doing across the country, comedy and music. Tonight. Going down tonight at the King Theater. Yes, we're here tonight. Here tonight. What? It's sold, <laughs> it's sold out tonight. So yeah, but, but we'll, we'll have to get that here. itinerary we'll and here. see when you all going to be somewhere real close. But tonight is sold out at the King's Theater. Well, yes. thank you very much. Yes. Yo, wow. And you know what? And thank everybody for even the the help and the push on the new single, Change Me. I really appreciate you guys so much. You oh, deserve it. A couple of the young ladies, we walked in and say, we heard the new single, Change Me. And it had me crying. It had me cry. I was like, really? Because that's my favorite song on the oh, album. Oh, really? Change me. Oh, yes. But, that's my song. <laughs> oh, I see. But you li- know what? There's, you know, every song that you release, let me just say, here at this radio station, Every time I play it, it seems like somebody calls in and heard it for the first time, and the reaction is the same. Like, they, you've touched their spirit. It's not only something that they oh, wow. hear, but you sing to people's spirit, wow. Tammy. Wow. So, you know, I'm, I don't doubt it. I haven't heard Change Me, but I will now. All oh, right. I'm going to take it. a listen to it. That, Matter of fact, I'm going to play it right now. That's How's that? That's one of them old school grandmama them songs. It is. Oh, grandmama right. Nim. See. When you gonna sing, David? We I'll be to trying do. to get David you to know, sing. You know, he can every sing. Time, we make this deal every time we get ready to. Do, we're getting ready for the pr- the production of the album. David, you gonna sing this with me? When it comes time to lay it, oh well, I'm just doing. I'm working on the paperwork. Well, because I have to make sure the album is put together yeah. and all that. Well, here's what we're going to do. Oh lord! For one of the episodes celebrating your thirtieth wedding anniversary, okay. you are gonna sing. That's a good idea. Hey. Where's my cut? <laughs> I didn't ask y'all nothing. <laughs> Remember that, bro, Clarence. There you go. All right? Man up and sing. Man up. 
I'm, hey, y'all check out the man. I don't on like TV this interview. One, Eight o'clock <laughs> Eastern. Hey, and then you can also it's a Tuesday t- Tuesday night takeover because we're on Bounce TV also at nine o'clock Eastern what? with the sitcom with, men, with man and wife. So y'all check us out. Follow us at David and Tamla Man. We love y'all. We gotta get out of here. Let me hold five dollars. Okay, I got you. Got you. Who my person? I got two and a half. The other grand. <laughs> all them eight grandkids we got got the other. <laughs>